It's the beginning of uh, September and I'm uh, standing, sitting actually at the Golgotha, the Calvary, the place that Jesus was crucified. Um, this time I'm here to light some candles of um, subscribers who ask me to do that. And uh, every time I'm trying to do that in a different way. This time I um, decided to take the candles with me and to visit and to visit um, uh, with you at the church and I will um, light it next to the tomb of uh, Jesus. This is where he was crucified and um, as you already know I'm a messenger. It doesn't matter if you're Catholic, uh, Protestant, uh, Greek Orthodox, um, Buddhist, Hindu, and Jew. I'm respecting everyone. And, and um, after that, I will go to the Western Wall and I will pray for the one who asked me to pray at the Western Wall as well. Uh, that is where they uh, nailed Jesus into the tomb. And to the left of it, you can see the figure of Mary. That's the Pieta. And the most important thing is to the left of it, and this is at the Greek Orthodox side, we are at the Catholic side now, and that's where he was crucified. And I will bless it at those two places now, and I will continue with you later uh, um, to the tomb of Jesus. And that is the Golgotha. That was Jesus was crucified. If you want me to light a candle for you in the church, and I'm doing it in so many churches in the Holy Land, um, just go to buy me a coffee link. The link is in my uh, description, and um, and ask me to do that. You can choose to support me or not. It doesn't matter. I will do that anyhow. Just a moment, please. Then we are leaving the Golgotha, the Calvary, and we will continue with the story. He was crucified here, and then they purified his body. They put a shroud around him, and they will and they may bury him. That we just came from, from here, from the Golgotha, and. Here you can see that they purified the body of Christ and they will bury him in a cave. Um, this place is where they anointed the body of Christ. I'm talking about that sin. In that case, the closest place to the body of Christ is right here. It's anointed. Mm. The smell is amazing. I 
and we will continue out to the tomb. That's where I'm gonna light the candles for you. Um, the tomb is right here. Uh, like a few years ago, let's say 10 years ago, I could light candles around it as well. Now I cannot. Oh, it's 12 o'clock. Jesus was crucified now. Then listen to the bells while you're looking at the tomb. A candle that you could see inside the first chapel, but there's a priest there and there's a man behind him. All right, now I can see the light. He's from the holy fire. Uh, every candle here are lit by the holy fire as well. Then those candles would be lit by that too. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna light the candles here, and then I will uh, pray uh, in Hebrew, and then not in the video. I will uh, continue to pray to say everything that you ask me to do. Oh, oh okay. Right, that, that, oops, there you go. that is from the fire, then I'm lighting the candles from here, see everything, I'm standing in the things. Right, I have to dissolve it because I know I'm left-handed, if it's a problem, The tomb, thank you, is right, right here. Ow. All right, let me stop. Let me do it. Oh, it's not so easy for me. Can you help me, please? Yeah, I know, I tried. That doesn't stand. Well, no, don't that do it. Alright, later on I will light a candle. Uh, more mm. candles. Uh, difficult. Wait a minute. Alright, mm. never mind. Yeah. Not the best candles I can see. Mm. All right. Now I can do that. Before. Yeah. All right. Here it is. Okay. Sorry, I'm a little bit clumsy today. Not easy. Yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. <laughs>
the things. Yeah, yeah, I'm pressing out with, with the candles. Oily because of the anointing. Because it was anointed. Here it is. Then I will light two more candles soon. And, um, oh, whoa, what's wrong? Wait a minute. All right, then, sorry, but let me put it correctly. I don't want to destroy the church. <clears throat> the candle is a bit disturbed. All right. Then, later on I will deal with it, I will buy more candles, but um, today it's so important for me. I'm doing it twice a month, then I'm actually entered to buy me a coffee twice a month and I'm reading each one of your commands and I'm lighting candles uh, to everyone who asks me to do that, but I'm ble blessing everyone who actually answer me even though he didn't ask me to light a candle for him there's a list of two pages here and it is in front of me and eight days ago my mother just died too my mother was a jewish woman just like mary was a jewish woman and she was very exactly like jesus the same day uh, they purified the body and they put a shroud around her. And this time I decided to, to read you um, Kaddish, which is a very important prayer, a uh, Jewish prayer. But uh, I will read it first in Hebrew and then I will read it in English. With my broken English, uh, it was difficult to translate it because it was written in Aramite. And in that case, the language that Jesus actually spoke as well. And uh, when I will say Amen, you can answer Amen too. And then I, you will understand that that prayer um, is one of the three most important prayers. Sounds like a Christian prayer as well. Then. It kadal vit kadash mi rabba be almadi baraki ruta, the amlich malhuta vit samach per kunavi karemishiha, behai hunubi in hun, behai the whole bed Israel, the glar bezman karivi mo, amen, amen. Ye eshma rabba mi vrach lo lime, a lolme, almayavit parahvit, the barvit paravit, romam, vit nasavit, a darvit, a lavit, lel shma de kutcha baroho. לעולה מכל ברכתה ושירתה תשבחתה ונחמתה בהמרין בעלמה ואמרו אמן אמן. That was in Hebrew. Now it's gonna be in my broken English. Glorified and sanctified be God's great name throughout the world which he has created according to to his will. May he establish his kingdom in your lifetime and during your days and within the life of the entire house of Israel. Speedily and soon and say Amen, Amen. May his great name be blessed forever and to all eternity blessed and praised, glorified and exalted. Um, and honored and uh, let it be the name of the Holy One. Blessed be He um, beyond all blessing and hymns, uh, prayers and uh, consul consolation that are ever spoken in the word and say, Amen. And that is the meaning of Kaddish, and uh, this time I'm praying for my mother as well. And because she was a Jew, uh, I will go to the Western world, Western world to pray as well. If you want me, if, if you like that video and you want to see more of Israel, I do have more than 19,000 videos, then subscribe my channel and follow me um, around the Holy city of Jerusalem and other places in the Holy Land, Israel and Palestine. 
see you in my next video.